welcome or welcome back to my channel, Boss Lady Vibes. If you have not yet subscribed to my channel, go ahead and subscribe. Like this video, share this video with everyone you know. Go ahead and follow me on TikTok, Boss Lady Vibes. That's B O S S L A D Y V I B E S. And on Instagram, Boss Lady Vibes X333. That's B O S S L A D Y V I B E S X333. Today, currently, um, I am on a run to Target. Exciting, right? A Target run. Um, I'm going to return this table lamp that my husband thought was cute to be a nightlight for my kids room but um no so the kids ended up getting scared of it because it's like it's a star wars knife so i'm gonna go ahead and return that and then we're gonna go ahead and look at a few things in target so i want you to go ahead and comment down below if you guys like star wars I've never really been a big fan, um, but, you know, to each his own. There's nothing wrong with that. But currently, I'm on my way over there. I know you guys have been asking me a lot of questions uh, about my cancer story. Um, I will go ahead and answer some of those questions shortly. Um... But tomorrow, actually tomorrow, I have a doctor's visit, a doctor's appointment with my oncologist. And an oncologist, if you guys don't know, um, is a cancer doctor. So I'm going to go ahead and go to my appointment tomorrow and see what my doctor tells me. Um, but so far, I do believe we have five sessions left. Um, that's if you know nothing goes wrong or there's not they don't find anything unexpected in the x-rays and all the tests that they are going to perform so that's very exciting i honestly can't wait because you see like my hair is growing back a little Put your seatbelt on the right way first. So my son wants to talk to you guys. Hi. Hi, family. Yeah. My two little pumpkins, so cute. You're not a pumpkin. So what are you? Romeo and Mateo. Yeah, good job. You're so smart. Yeah. Yep. Oh my goodness. If you guys look behind me right now, it's gonna pour. Like, literally, it's literally gonna pour. Like, it is so. I don't know if you guys can see, maybe in the rear view mirror. I don't know. It is literally going to pour. But anyways, guys, I'm going to pull up here shortly in a minute. Um, and then we'll see what Target has in store for us. Looks like it's going to rain, so I need to hurry up and just get in the store before it starts raining. 
So, oh, another thing, right? I went to the gym with my sister-in-law and I went to the gym with my sister-in-law and her son, right? Mind you, I love going to the gym with other people because it's like motivation to like work harder. But my legs, it was leg day and my legs are killing me. Like, killing me, killing me, killing me. And I want to go back to the, it was, it was like two days ago I went to the gym. So I went to the gym Monday, today is Wednesday. And so my legs are killing me, but I want to go to the gym tonight. My husband gets home from work. And then another thing is too, you guys, um, you guys have been asking about my husband why isn't he in the videos is he shy is he not supporting you well it's just that he works a lot like he's a very hard worker and he works a lot especially now that i'm not working he needs to like pull my slack basically so that's pretty much what you know what the deal is um other than that, I do have a... <laughs> My baby's so cute. But yeah, so now that I'm not working, I do have a GoFundMe. It's in the description down below. Um, Go ahead and click on the description down below and then you will see the link to the GoFundMe so if you're feeling generous um, to help me with my cancer treatments um, then you can go ahead and donate um, but yeah so now I'm just looking for a parking oh my goodness yeah my bikes are raining yeah, it's gonna start raining soon. Yeah. Honestly, I used to feel some type of way going out like this, like without a wig or anything like that. But I just gotta like get to my mindset to where like I don't care what other people think because I really don't. Because I do feel a lot more comfortable going out like this. Because, you know, as far as, um, as far as, like, comfortability-wise, I don't want to be wearing a hat all day because I want my head to breathe. I love, like, feeling the fresh air and stuff. Comment down below if you guys like Target. If you guys have a Target addiction. I don't. But I do love, like, I really love Target. I really do. I love, love, love Target. Another. Yes, I love Target. Do I love Target loves Target too? I know my husband yesterday he came home because he he actually went to target yesterday and he ended up buying the kids um each a toy and you know oh this lady's leaving so nice
say bye to the lady. Today's actually the next day. So guys, today's actually the next day. So I went to my doctor's appointment already. Um, basically, you know, I got some news at the doctor's. And, <coughs> excuse me. I literally went out like this because I said, you know what? Ugh, it's too hot to be wearing a hat. And a wig, even less, is way too hot. So, I'm currently sitting outside of a dealership right now waiting for my husband to come back in. But, anyways, for those of you guys who support me, I just want to say thank you, thank you so much. Um, for those of you guys who have been leaving ugly comments under my YouTube, um, saying hurtful things to me, I hope that you have a blessed day and I wish nothing but the best for you. Um, maybe occupy yourself with some other things to do um, instead of being negative or talking about how the way that I eat a certain way um, I really you know don't pay attention to none of that because at the end of the day everyone has their opinions everyone does certain things that may bother others or you know maybe they're just bored with their life anyways back to my cancer update um i do want to go ahead and answer some of your questions that you guys had for me already um i will get to them shortly um i know a lot of you guys have been asking me um what stage cancer um and how do they make up the stages of cancer um, basically, the stages of cancer, I started out at a stage 3. Um, the stages of cancer basically mean, um, stage 1 means that basically you have cancer from either your head um, just down to your chest. Um, and that's what they see on the PET scan when they do the exams. Stage 2 may mean, so stage Two may mean that you have cancer from your head all the way down to your chest or your stomach. Um, stage three may mean you have it on more than half of your body. 
so basically from your head all the way down to your stomach or your waist or maybe um, some in your legs but mostly the um, the waist is the cutoff stage four means that your whole body's infected you have cancer from your head all the way down to your toes so those are the stages um, I hope that helped you guys um, in explaining this um, a little bit better um, I will go ahead and go into like a more detailed Q&A as far as cancer is involved you can always go ahead and DM me at Boss Lady Vibes x333 on my Instagram um, you can also comment down below any questions you may have concerning my cancer um, so far with my doctor visits um, he really like I guess it jinxed me in a way. At first, he told me that I only had one chemo left, and I was like, whoop de doo, so excited, like about to cry, had me in tears. But then he was like, wait a minute. Because I told him, I was like, from my understanding, our last chemo or our last appointment was that I had five left. So it's true. I do have five left, and they're going to be really strong. That's what he did explain to me. Give it a little toe. Um, I do have five left so basically that means that I have excuse my kids in the background I don't know why I have this here like uh, it's eczema or dry spot but basically means that I have one next Thursday that's the one one I have two in September two no two in August and then the other two in September. So they're every other Thursday, twice a month. Which is good because it does give me some time to um, recover. But I'm not sure if you guys could tell from my first <coughs> video. Go ahead and check that video out. Um, if you can see, I'm able to wear a tank top now. I had... Um, my cancer was like right here and it was like a big lump like it was humongous um, it is going away now to where I can actually wear a tank top and feel comfortable doing that um, but comment down below any questions that you guys may have for me um, I know it's like kind of all over the place but they did send me to do lab work again. That right there, just that. That right there. So cute, them bonding. Also, comment down below what other videos you guys may want me to do. Be they cooking videos or vlogs or any type of videos. Um, yeah. So you can go ahead and find me on Instagram. Boss Lady Vibes X333. That's B O S S L A D Y V I B E S X333. Also follow my TikTok, Boss Lady Vibes. That's B O S S L A D Y V I B E S. And don't forget to subscribe to the, my channel, comment down below, and um, like this video, share this video with everyone you know. If you know someone that's going through this, you know someone who has cancer or you know if they feel like they're ever alone um i just want to end off this video by saying don't ever feel like you're alone because there's a lot of people a lot of people going through this and <laughs> my kids there's a lot of people in this world going through this and a lot of people really don't put it out there because they're probably scared of what other people may think or they're probably they probably think that they're the only one going through this and they don't know how to express themselves well i'm here for you guys if you guys ever know of someone that just needs support you can always reach them out to me and i will gladly go ahead and respond and help you through this journey um as i am going through this journey myself as well but i just want everyone to feel like you know they're not the only ones that they're going through this because you know there's always a helping hand so all right guys bye